everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today is a really, really highly anticipated video for me because I've been waiting for this item to come in for not one, not two, but three whole months. I placed the order for this handbag back in mid-October and it is finally here, middle of January. So I'm so excited to do this DHgate handbag unboxing. I don't know whether or not I should tell you what the handbag is going to be or I'll just show you. I think I'll just show you. So it came in this packaging, no box. So any guesses based on the size? Because this is the full size of the bag I can feel. This is the top and this is the bottom of the bag. Yeah, any guesses what you think it might be? Alright, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this because I don't want to the bag itself. I'm so excited to open this. I've been checking the shipping information on this nearly every day for three months. Ooh, and I think it comes with a free gift as well. Very nice. It does, it comes with a really cute scarf for the bag. So as you can see, it's Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton. This is so gorgeous that I love the colors. So this is a little tule for the handle. Can't wait to pop that on there. And then it just comes like this. Can you see, yeah. Any guesses? Pause the video now and just put a guess in the comment section below. What is this handbag? I will wait. Oh, wow. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm just going to remove the plastic on it really quickly and then I will show you the bag. Are you ready? So it's meant to be a Louis Vuitton on the go and it's absolutely stunning. Right off the bat I will tell you that it definitely does, you can tell that it's a fake because it says Supreme, it's got Supreme on this side and that side. Um, I've looked at pictures of the real one and they have all of this um, standard Louis Vuitton print all over the bag itself but they, I can't find any that say Supreme on it, so I definitely think that's a massive giveaway, but I still think the bag is stunning itself. Um, so it's just got these two top handles. It has got gold hardware, and it's got um, gold here, gold on the zip as well. It actually has two non-detachable shoulder straps as well, so you can pop it on your shoulder. It's got, let me just open it up, a little bit more. It's really big and spacious on the interior and as you can see it is that bright gorgeous luscious Louis Vuitton red on the inside. It's got a zip pocket at the back and then it's got one big internal slip pocket at the front and then just a big open section. The quality of it is really really nice. Really, really nice. The zips are nice. Let me just check the main zip. Yep, yeah, that's so smooth. Super buttery. Really nice to open and close. And the feel of it is just so, so lovely. And I can't really see any stitching issues. Everything looks really uniform, really neat. I'll show you close up what the print looks like. So it is absolutely gorgeous. There isn't really much I can fault about it other than obviously you can tell that it is a fake by the fact that it does say Supreme. If anybody knows 
of um, the genuine item saying Supreme on it, please do leave me a comment and let me know down below because I've Googled it and I can't see any that say Supreme. But this is just going to be a really nice bag. I've been wanting a bigger bag so that I can maybe stop taking a handbag and a nappy bag when I go out with my son. I think it would just be easier to have a bigger bag so that I can just pop stuff in that I need and have everything in one bag. And this is going to come in really handy, the fact that I can pop it over my shoulder. I just really, really like it. And obviously you can't go wrong with a black bag. Black bags are just absolutely classic they just work with any outfit whether or not you're dressed up or super casual and i feel like this could even be a really nice date bag you could take it out on a date night you could take it to the cinema maybe sneak a few snacks in the cinema in this handbag you could use it as a work bag that would be an amazing work bag especially if you're anyone like myself i used to work in an office i would have loved to have had this like propped up on the desk next to me um so yeah i'm really really happy with it i will leave a link to this exact item if i can find it still because like i say it has been three months since i bought it and sellers don't often sell the same stock on dhgate it is very um it's very much consistently changing on there and they're constantly running out of specific items on the website so i will definitely try and link this if not something similar for you um if you are interested obviously please be aware that it does say supreme on it and like i say i don't think that the genuine one does say that the genuine bag i believe it's around two and a half thousand pounds this bag cost me let me just have a look sorry so an on the go gm is two thousand three hundred and fifty pounds and this bag cost me and this bag cost me £39.18, albeit it did take three months to get to me, but obviously the price difference is just so drastic. Um, I'm going to try and put the scarf on the handle just to see what it would look like. So I'm just doing this roughly just so that you can get an idea but I think that would look really nice. You could either wrap it round just one handle or you could maybe you can maybe even just like tie it in a little bow on the side. I think that looks really cute. I think I would probably wear it that way. I'm under no illusion that I'm going to be fooling anyone into thinking that this is the real genuine item but I do think that I am going to wear this. I think it's going to be a really nice handbag to use on an everyday basis for me and I'm really looking forward to wearing it. The faux leather is super super smooth. It's really nice. There are no feet at the bottom. It just feels really good quality. The top handle straps as well, they're really nice and thick. They're not cheap feeling. Yeah, I'm really happy with this handbag and I'm so glad to finally have it in my collection. I know that was a really short and sweet video but I really hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. Let me know down below if you've got any recommendations for any DHgate handbags or accessories. I would love to know. I really hope you enjoyed watching today's video and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye!